Let's check the open circuit voltage and short circuit current of the individual solar panels. I'm getting 22.8 volt VOC and 1.78 amps ISC from a single Bluebird solar panel I recently bought. Since we are building a 12 volt system using a PWN charge control, we have to connect all the four panels in parallel so that we will get a VOC of 22 volt and a combined ISC of around 8 amps. We have 4-in-1 T4 MC4 branch connectors to easily and effortlessly connect four similar panels in PAL. You can buy this from my Amazon store. Connect all the positive leads to one branch connector and all the negatives to the other. Now we have a common positive and negative output leads to which I'm going to connect the wire using a pair of MC4. You can easily calculate the DC wire gauge using any of the online wire gauge calculators. Let's check the VOC and ISC of a solar array we just connected together. Adjust the multimeter to read 10 ampere range and then connect the testing leads to the solar panel output. When we are connecting an ammeter to a solar panel, we are actually short circuiting the panel. This means the maximum current will flow through the circuit. Here we get an ISC of 8 amps. Adjust the multimeter to read VOC of a solar panel. When we connect the voltmeter to a solar panel, we are actually connecting it in parallel, so the circuit is open. Then we'll get the maximum voltage the solar panel can supply in a given solar radiation. Here we get a VOC of 22 volt.